What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Zenith and today we're going to go through a Warden customization guide. You guys seem to enjoy the last one, so this is going to be a updated one to that. Now, if you like if you haven't seen my old video and you want to look at what style I'm using for that Warden, you can check it out. It'll be down in the description below. With that being said, let's get started. So, as you can see, if you watched my last video, as you can see, my Warden's different, right? I went with a whole new theme. I didn't go with the black theme. I, I wanted to try something different. So first and foremost, the ornament. Still rocking this OG ornament, bro. Pegasus Rider. I gotta stay with it, bro. I, there's no ornament that compares to it, man. I love it. It's literally ever since I got this ornament, it's never changed. Like I'm keeping this. This is not going to change. This is the default state right now. All these other ones. The only one that would come close to having its spot is probably. This one, the obsidian crown. The obsidian crown looks pretty good, but still, man, I don't know. And this, the iron worm, iron worm, it looks pretty good. All these other ones, I'm not, I'm not with it. <laughs> I just, I can't get with it, man. I love that ornament so, so much. So the chill tomb helm. This is a newer uh, helmet. I didn't know it existed for the longest. Before I used to rock the horse lord helm, but that, the skull, man, it looks so different from the rest of them. I just I like it now I finally got it these right here I mean that's pretty cool I kind of like that but they're not they're not really you know I don't, I don't think they look that good and for these helmets I like that you can see his eyes but the helmets still kind of ugly like this one kind of looks good this one does but I really I just don't like it I don't like them that I don't like them that well so I'm sticking with this one and also I don't have these yet so that's another reason so the next thing we have is the chest piece the chest piece i really i'm kind of up in the air with it and keep in mind guys I, i'm not really focusing on the perks activating the perks right now this is just for looks i'll mess around and try to upgrade my you know my gear to what i want in the future but I, right now I, i'm not going to focus on that so the jasper chest this is what i'm rocking really because the uh, skull and bones on it that's pretty much it for the chest pieces on the warden, it's, it's not much to it. Instead of this one. Oh, wait a minute. I didn't even see that. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, let me go and slide that one on right there. I like that. Okay, so, yeah, that's the new chest piece. I just, in the intrepid, intrepid wildcat chest. I think I'm saying that right. Correct me if I'm wrong, but that looks, that looks really good. And the bottom part looks pretty good, too. It's not all torn and stuff. I like it. I mean, it's still torn, but it looks more. I don't know. It looks more put together. So for the shoulders, the shoulders I really haven't changed much. I think the last time around I was using these shoulders, but uh, I'm rocking this. I just like the one big side on the left. It's just something I really enjoy for some reason. I like them to be disproportional. But that's really not. It's not really much to say about the, ch the shoulders. Now the sword just like with the ornament i'm rocking the freaking caliber blade man the caliber blade i love it love it that it's curved all these other swords aren't really messing with it in my opinion and this hilt goes well with it and that's because i mean i know it's kind of you know it's kind of it has a kind of a, you know those green spots in there but i really don't pay attention to that i still think it looks good but what I like about this sword and, and the, I mean the hilt and the blade is it goes that hilt becomes white once you use a certain shader. Now I'm going to get into my shader actually. So I use the thin ice. As you can see, it says unlock by acquiring the Frostwind Festival bundle or scavenging the battlefield. So you got to get it during that time when all that was going on. Sorry guys, my voice is going out, but it changes. It it, it gives them a good look. And it's really, it pairs well with the silver. I really like it being paired well with the silver. I mean, it can go good with the black also, if you want to pull off a certain look. But I really like it going with the silver. It looks really good. And it goes with a um, with another thing. So, actually, you know what? I noticed something about this chest piece that I'm going to have to go back on. I don't like the fact that it doesn't show the little, the two things on the side, like, on the bottom part so on his standards I don't like the fact that that's not showing because look the total look I want to get for this guy is like 
he's supposed to be like you know like a lighter character you know light lighter things are usually um paired with good goodness but he's like a light character with a dark purpose pretty much so like as you can see he has the death symbols on it and you know he, he has skulls everywhere it's it's, it's, it's kind of unorthodox i like it so with all that being said let's get to the execution now grave passing i love this execution it's new and i'm really enjoying it with the assassin's creed effect for some odd reason i feel like it matches my guy and it goes well with that execution we have knockout you know gotta keep the hell's gate I believe it's hell's gate just think it goes good with it blackstone bash that's a good one a moment of silence i like this one this is one of my this, this was one of my favorites it's a really good uh, execution so all these other ones i don't know man uh Oh yeah, oh yeah, I forgot about that. that's the newest one I believe. Yeah, I'm gonna pick that up definitely. As soon as I get seven thousand, I'm picking that up. Been focusing too much on my Black Prior, so kill card, you know, gotta represent the YouTube. Gotta keep that on there. Volcanic destruction blast, that's a good one. Perfect form right there. I love it. Goes good actually with the Hell's Gate also. I mean the um. What the the fire wings? I forgot what it's called. Sword point. Now this, uh, if you guys watched my last video, you know that sword point. I love it, bro. <laughs> That's my favorite. Blade homage. You know when you want to show respect to your fellow wardens, do that blade homage. I think that's how you say that. Uh, knuckle crack and blade polish. Actually, I have not seen the blade polish. Actually, you know I've seen somebody do that. Knuckle crack. The signatures, I really don't think the signatures are worth it because you see them for the, a total of three seconds. So I really don't get into that. But I mean, if I was to, I'd probably do the blade polish. It looks pretty good. And as you uh, can see, I'm on the effects. So, like, I showed you what I would, you know, use with the executions before. Uh, idle, I like to use Hellfire. I like the wings. As you can see. But I, actually, I'm probably going to do darkness on something because I just want you know I want some contrast on there it looks it looks pretty good though it looks pretty good especially when you do the uh, executions you don't see darkness that much Let's see this it just looks like his soul's leaving his body I like it you know, free roam, hellfire, combat, lucky strike, and the tempest. It goes well with it. And as for the feats, I don't know if I did the feats last time, but what I rock is body count, thick blood, second win, and moral uh, morale booster. Catapult, you know, it takes much longer to you know come down, so I really don't like using cat catapult uh, anymore. If I'm like really ganking tough, I might use the stalwart banner, but I usually rock the morale bo booster. And this is usually the default settings. I usually don't change all this. As for mask and stuff, I really don't rock mask. If you're wondering that, I might. But these ornaments, man, I only I only buy these outfits for the ornaments for real. And you know, for the warden, nothing really appealed to me besides the ornament I have. So that's about it, guys. That's that's it for the customization. I really. I really wanted to, you know, do something opposite from what I had last time. So, you know, experiment with your warden. If you like this look, try some things from it. I don't know. I just, it's, it's I don't know. It's what I like. <laughs> you might not like it, but that's it for the video, guys. Leave a like if you like the video. If you really enjoy the video, maybe even try subscribing. My name is Zenith, and like always, I'll see you guys at the top.